me another extra hundred dollars for my bag but those kind people at Eva Airways checked it in for free for me and they gave me an emergency seat which is a huge that's like one of the biggest pluses so thank you guys at Eva Airways for uh, helping me out big time with all of that it made my whole trip so much more smooth <laughs> Transaction completed. Here and then left? Okay. So Taipei 35 mini. Yes. Okay. okay. Thank you. Me before told me to follow this green G. Here's my plan. I have 24 hours in Taipei, in Taiwan. Uh, I'm going to Chimen. Chimen. That's where my good buddy Richard Wan told me to go. I want to find some really good food, some really good people. I don't know. I don't know what my plan is, but that's what I love about coming to places like this for 24 hours. You never really know what you're gonna do or what's gonna happen, but that's okay. That's just the way it is. I think I made it. Absolutely no idea where to go. And I haven't even booked a place for tonight. I'm just gonna walk around and try to find a hostel, so. Fingers crossed I find a fun one. Hmm. Left or right? I am so lost right now. <laughs> but I love it. It's probably one of my favorite things and feelings is being in a new city you've never been to before and have absolutely no freaking idea where you are, where you're going, where you're staying. It's the fun of it. So there's no rooms here at the WOW Hostel, but Billy, my man Billy, yeah, help me out. He's taking me to the Space Inn, so we're gonna go you there. Come back. I will, I'm gonna come back, I'm gonna come back. WOW Hostel. <laughs> so, uh, if you're really lost, okay. yeah. you just show people the address of the Space Inn, a Mandarin name, okay. and the phone number. Yeah. So, thank, you. thank you. Thank you. Have a good one, guys. Bye-bye. Whew! <laughs> This is oh, not yeah. too, it's not too bad. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. What was your name? George. George? I'm Brett. Yeah. Hey, yeah, sure, sure. So I've been here for like five minutes and like the first place I go to, this guy Georgie approaches me and helps me out. So uh, some very helpful, kind people here in Taiwan. I'm liking it so far. And he's giving me free coffee and a beer. Like. So the place that that WOW hostel recommended me to go stay because they were booked is like, I don't know, I think it's like a 10 minute walk from here, so I'm just gonna have a coffee and I'm gonna go try to find it. Now he's, uh, now he's giving me some fries. What a guy. Thank you. This is my king dog. Wee! Look at that view. That's awesome. Okay? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And then go here. All right. Thank you so much. I appreciate Bye. it. That's crazy. Like my first five minutes here, I got offered free food. He even showed me a hostel to stay at, which unfortunately couldn't let me stay there because they were full. He gave me a meal and he even offered me a place to stay the next time that I'm back in Taipei. So that is, that's crazy, man. Like there's so many nice people out here in the world. Law of attraction, if you're a great person, you're gonna attract great people. I firmly believe that. I'm on my way to find this space in. <laughs> I love being
being in new cities so much. It's so amazing. You just get a new feeling you've never felt before in your life. It's like you're a little kid and around every corner is something new. It's so, so awesome. I love it. I am the world's biggest idiot. I left my suitcase at, at George's place. Oh my God. I'm just gonna check into here and then I'm gonna have to run back to go get it. No, I'm so stupid, man. How? Watch out. Apparently you gotta watch out around here. <laughs> hey! <laughs> hey! I know I was gonna bring cool. this back now because I forgot it. Shout out to the That's funny. hilarious. I know, hey. Okay. Thanks so much. I appreciate it. I'll yeah. see you tomorrow, yeah? yeah okay, yeah, yeah. take care. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Bye. <laughs> That's what happens when you're having too good of a time. You forget your luggage. Or no, you don't. Maybe that's just me because I'm dummy. The humble abode. We're all good. I got everything in my room now. Oh, so Georgie boy earlier, he was telling me to uh, go check out this place called Red House. I don't know if he's referring to a party spot or if it's just a nice place to go see stuff. So I'm gonna go check that out right now. And then after that, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Find some food, find some cool people to hang out with. I got about an hour and a half to get to the airport before I check in. So, I'm just gonna rip back, back to where I was yesterday to try to find a quick little bite to eat, and then I'll be on my way. It's a beautiful morning out here in Taipei. I do wish I had more time here, but it's another reason to come back. You guys have a very, very clean city. It's really, really nice coming to these countries and appreciating how well you guys keep up your streets. It's nice, it's very enjoyable. fresh fruit start the day right. Oh. I have absolutely no idea what this is, but it looks good, so I'm gonna get it. Yeah. It's like a potato pancake with egg. It's pretty good. I don't think I should have finished that whole thing. I feel like now. Anyways. Let's go to the airport.
how I've missed you. It's good to be back. I miss the warmth. I can't wait to see the homies. I haven't seen Dan for like a month. It's not as hot as I thought it'd be in the airport. Just wait till we get outside. I'm just wondering how many weird looks I'm gonna get with this hockey bag. A Benyaga carrying a hockey bag around. It's actually not that hot out right now, which I'm faking the Lord because I just came from a really cold freaking place. This is nice. Last time I arrived in Manila, I think it was like January, last January, no, March, last March, when I came from home. So it was a way bigger difference. It was way, way, way warmer. Just waiting for my grab. <laughs> I'm like chasing him right now. He said, that he was at the right stop, but he's at a different one. Now he says he's at Jolly B. But it's probably one of my least favorite things is trying to find Grab and Uber drivers. Ah, uh, Salamat. Hey! hey I, you were up, and yes. then I went down, yeah. and then you went down, and I went up. <laughs> what is that, Pensy? What is it? Up, man? How you doing? Good to see you, bro. You're all sweaty. Yay! Hey. Hey. How you doing, bud? I see you working out in there. <laughs> yeah, I try to work out. Put the sweat on. I'm not actually having got. I didn't break a sweat. Yeah. Your hair's growing too. I'm growing my hair longer. I like it. Buddy. See, it's all. It's a trend now. Uh, <laughs> man. Oh, hello, everyone's on. <laughs> hello, everybody. Uh, you guys should subscribe to my channel because uh, I, I, as of right now, I'm uh, I'm releasing the Cebuano series. And for all you foreign folk out there, Cebu is a place in the southern Philippines. It's an adventure, and you should subscribe to me because I'm Irish. And there you go. Hey, how's it going everybody? I just finished editing the new vlog and I just posted it. Swipe up to give it a watch. Uh, I'm currently just on my way to North Edza Mall to watch Shargal the movie featuring myself and your boy Will Dasovich. It's finally time to see who's most cringeworthy. I'm kind of nervous actually. I see that booty, I grab it. Ugly got ball like a maverick. 